What does Comics 35 do? Comics 35 is based on Exodus 35, verses 30 to 35, which as most of you here being uh, artists know are the verses about God gifting the artisans who will create the works of art for the tabernacle. And they're not only God gives them the ability to create the art, he uh, teaches them how to, or shows them how to teach others. And I worked for uh, Archie and DC and Marvel and Jim Henson for years, and the Lord took me into, after 20 years of working in that, in my own studio, into this ministry of Comics 35 of teaching other people how to produce their own comics for their own people in their own languages around the world. And uh, so that's what we've been doing. Uh, and well, you'll see on the back of our shirts that our whole thing is to lead people to Jesus Jesus Christ through the visual storytelling medium of comics. So, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, this, uh, that, this is all the uh, my flapping my mouth part of this presentation, and uh, everything else will be video, uh, and you can roll that now, please. Hello everyone, my name is Gabrielle Geski. I am Thai American, born and raised in Chiang Mai, Thailand, and now live in Fargo, North Dakota, USA. Currently, I work as a freelance artist as well as a staff for FCS, uh, the Frontier Comics Seminar Program, a um, comics workshop heavily inspired by Nate Butler and the Comics 35 Ministry. I first heard about Comics 35 when I met Nate Butler at one of his comic uh, workshops. Uh, he was teaching through the SOCAM, the School of Cartooning and Animation in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Last year, he invited me to help ex expand the Comics 35 ministry in uh, East Asia. And right now, we are hoping to see uh, some doors open next year for us to be able to go and start working in Japan. But before that happens, we have a lot of preparation and prayer that needs to be done, and we'll see, Lord willing, what he has in store for us in the future. So I'm glad to be here and looking forward to meeting you all. Thank you. My name is Yago Williams and I'm a member of the Comics 35 team thanks to Nate Butler and I'm a member of the Conquerors International Strength Team. We are a group of athletes that travel all over the world doing feats of strength while spreading the gospel of Jesus Christ. Christ, 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 Christ. I have a comic book style but I'm not a professional comic book artist. I just well, I became a Christian about 11 years ago, and on that day, I really wanted to give God my all, and that uh, included my talent. So I draw to honor God, and I'm really excited about being included in this, uh, this project because I, I've been asking God to show me a way to be able to use my artwork to bring him glory and if there's any way that I could show someone else how to use their artwork to do the same thing, I would love to be a part of something like that. Above everything else, I want my artwork to be used to bring honor to God. The name above all names, Jesus Christ. Thank you. Hi, my name is Ian Dale, and I'm an illustrator for Children's Books and Media based in Los Angeles, California. I went to art school and I actually started out there as an atheist, uh, but during my time in college I came to faith and it just really transformed my perspective and gave me a new purpose. Since that time I've really been seeking ways to tie my artistic interests with kingdom endeavors, and as a freelancer for the last 12 years I've had some great opportunities to team up with different missions-minded organizations. One of those is the American Bible Society, which is a trauma healing program. Uh, with World Vision for their child sponsorship, I've created illustrated booklets. And then I've also was part of a team of artists that worked on the Bible app for kids, which has animated Bible stories uh, available in over 40 different languages around the world. 
and most recently I've been working on a couple of children's books called the Advent Storybook and the Easter Storybook. And with those, we really want to bring families together with a focus on Christ around the holidays. As an artist, I tend to work long hours alone behind my computer, and so I was really glad that through social media I was able to meet Nate Butler and, and also learn find out about Comics 35 so I can see what other artists out there in the field are doing. So I'm glad to be here. Hi, my name is Jose Carlos Gutierrez. I'm 42 years old. I live in Mexico City. I've been doing comics since 2005 when I entered the International Christian Comics Competition held by Comics 35. And by the grace of God, I won the first uh, place in the amateur category. Since then, I've been uh, serving with uh, Comics 35 different activities. I've been trainer in three seminars in Mexico City, a workshop in Lit World, Singapore, and different uh, webinars. I've been published in Christian Magazine in Mexico City and in a youth magazine in Kenya. So it's great to be here with you. Hi, Dave Durham here at your service, hailing from Tamalewood in New Mexico, otherwise known as the Burque here locally, or Albuquerque. I'm a spying illustrator. I met Nate Butler in the late 80s when my mission group to the Choctaws stopped in a McDee's in a tiny town, and I was illustrating at a table. And Nate had just walked in behind my booth. Nate made a comment about my art being cool and said he had something for me in his car, which turned out to be an A to Z comic he had created with a number of other fairly well-to-do artists. As my emphasis for saving souls dominated my thoughts in those years and wasting time drawing was last on my mind, and I'd actually been offered an opportunity to train at Marvel Comic through a schoolmate whose uncle worked at Marvel and I declined. Later on, decades down the road, when my own evangelistic efforts didn't pan out, I had visited Nate and I saw how fruitful he seemed to be and envied his accomplishments, but kept telling myself I could somehow divorce myself from my artistic abilities and my calling to evangelize. I look forward to being used for Kingdom Works and anticipate the need to use the remainder of my days in the accurate communication and representation of the gospel. Hi, I'm Jeremy Lacasse. I'm a French Canadian from Montreal in Quebec. I worked for five years as a mason. I've just recently returned in university to be a social worker. I am married and I've been an involved member of my church since 2010 where I got baptized after uh, putting my trust in Christ. I've always enjoyed drawing, and since I'm really young, I, I don't remember when I really started. I met Nate uh, from uh, Comics 35 in 2011, uh, from a comic book conference he held in uh, Quebec, and he came back in 2015, where yeah, I took part in the same conference with him again. This was the first time I got published, and this is what we did. And I am honored to be invited uh, to the gathering in Tennessee, and uh, I am looking forward to meeting you all. My name is Marissa Pauser, and I am 26 years old from the United States. Uh, currently, I am a hairdresser, but I enjoy doing freelance illustration, graphic arts, and some cartooning. Um, my affiliation with Comics 35 was while I was 
in the School of Cartooning and Animation for Missions in Taiwan. I have been interested in cartooning since a very young age, probably oh, like two or three. I've always enjoyed manga and anime, anything that just sparks a fascination with beauty, so I guess that's where the hairstylist piece comes in. A lot of my artwork is very fun and colorful. Uh, as opposed to drawing comics and manga, I do a lot of watercolor and a little bit of acrylic. I enjoy working with uh, light colors and things that just kind of make you feel happy. I enjoy uh, charcoal as well, so a lot of realism. I'm excited to be meeting other artists here at the gathering. It's so exciting to be here in Nashville and a big honor to be invited. So thank you so much. Hi, I'm Flex Skillet and I'm from the United Kingdom. And I've known Nate Butler for about 20, 27 years. Back then I had hair, glasses and a beard. A lot has changed. I draw, I write, comics of course. I've been doing those a long, long time and I'm still doing them now. And I work for people like the Salvation Army. And I produce stuff for lots of different publishers, for the BBC, for uh, Toyota, the car manufacturer, I've drawn for them too, for uh, the English Football Association. I write and draw for lots of different uh, companies and people. Well, and also, I'll tell you what, I do my own comic too. Self-published comic that is, called Mockingbird, it's a science fiction tale. You're probably seeing lots of the pictures coming up now as I'm talking, exciting stuff. So I'm Flick Skillet, and I'll be in Nashville very soon. In fact, I'm now rambling. Anyway, take care. Hi, I'm Preston Morgan. I'm 17 years old, and I'm from Houston, Texas. I've been a Christ follower for several years, and every day I try and go closer to God and find new ways to love Him and to serve those around me. Even though I've been drawing for a really long time and I've known Nate for several years, this is really my first time working with Comic 35. But I'm really excited about the opportunity, and I'm really excited to see what God's going to do with it to impact His kingdom. I think art is super important as a form of creative expression because it's a really good way to communicate our love for God and God's love for us and the hope that we have people who don't understand that and who really need it. In a way, we're sort of like God's works of art in that he had an image in mind for us and he had a creative purpose for us. And as we become closer to him and we become more defined by our relationship to him, I think that the picture of us becomes more clear and more fleshed out as we become more and more the masterpieces he intends us to be. One thing you should know about me is I really love to learn, I really love to grow, I'm always picking up new techniques and trying out new art styles and anytime anyone wants to show me a trick or something that they know, I'm always open to learning that. Overall, I'm just super excited about Comic 35 and the opportunity that God has to further his kingdom. Hi, my name is Robert Flores. I'm the founder of Bible Art Books, based out of Riverside, California. For the last 20 years, I've been privileged to be able to work on different kinds of tracks, comics, and short stories that have been able to reach people in all kinds of walks of life. Some of the missions organizations that I've worked with have been able to produce tracks such as these, comic book based tracks that have reached people who would never read the Bible, but they would read a comic book. And we've heard several stories over the mission field over the years of people coming to know the Lord through comic books. Uh, I'm very passionate about using comic books as a medium to reach people and show the gospel of Jesus Christ with them. I'm very excited also about Comics 35 and how God has raised them up to be a leader in using comics to reach people. Thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of this movement. God bless.